Welcome back to Tain Slayer Info. Whenever the flight shelf life of a missile is completed, normally it is recommended to remove them completely from service, but coming out with an innovative idea to use the same for some other purpose in a safe manner needs real appreciation. The missile which has completed its flight shelf life is the Russian R-73E air-to-air missile. Before proceeding further, let me give quick information on what actually is a flight shelf life. An air-to-air -air missile's shelf life is the time the missile spends in storage. Once the shelf life is completed, these missiles are unfit to be used for flight operation since in storage, missile components might corrode or degrade over time. Once such components corrode, these missiles might not hit the target accurately or it might not get equipped properly on the fighter or sometime it might not get fired during critical combat situations which is indeed dangerous. Now since the Russian R-73E air-to-air missiles have completed their shelf life, the 7 base repair depot and 11 base repair depot of the Indian Air Force have designed and developed the summer air defense system. SUMMER is an acronym for Surface Air Missile for Assured Retaliation and the latest update regarding this air defense system is about the clearance for induction. To be more precise, the SUMMER Air Defense System has completed all firing trials and has been cleared for induction. To give more information about this air defense system, this system has been integrated on Ashok Leyland 4 into 4 Stallion Mark IV vehicle. The maximum range of this system is 12 km and it can be used to target low-flying objects like unmanned aerial vehicles, helicopters and fighters. The Russian R-73E missile has been reprogrammed to be used in this air defense system and the launcher used is the P-172D rail launcher and it can be fired in single or salvo mode. So that was a video to provide an update on the summer air defense system which has cleared firing trials and it is ready for induction. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned to Tainslade Info for more defense and aviation related updates. Thank you.